Hi, if you have attended AWS reInvent, I'm sure you picked up one of these tiny buttons that look like Amazon Dash. I was lucky enough to pick one, and as soon as I came back, I have gone ahead and configured that with AWS IoT. Now, these Amazon Dash-like buttons are pre-configured to talk to AWS IoT. They come with all the SDK certificates and connectivity to talk to the brand new platform that AWS has launched. So this is a thing that can talk to multiple other things over the new IoT platform. So what I'm going to demonstrate is how this Amazon Dash-like button talks to another thing that I have, which is called the LeafX bulb. If you're not familiar with LeafX, it is essentially a smart bulb, which is like Philips Hue, but doesn't have a hub. It's a standalone Wi-Fi connected bulb that can be programmatically accessed over REST API. So that's the thing I want to control with the Amazon Dash-like thing. So when I click the button once, it takes about 10 seconds to establish connectivity with my local Wi-Fi and send a message to AWS IoT, which I intercept and send another HTTP call to my bulb. So in, in, in 10 seconds, the bulb should glow. There we go. Now the LeafX bulb is glowing and it's red in color. Now I'm going to double tap the button and that's going to send a different message to AWS IoT. And I have again intercepted that and I'm going to change the color of the bulb from red to green. So once the, the process finishes, we'll see the color of the bulb changing. And there we go. That's not all. I can even press and hold the button for a longer time, which is going to send a long click message to the IoT platform. And then I'm going to change the color of the bulb from green to blue. Let's give it some time and it's going to change the color. There we go. So this was extremely simple. And what I have done here is pretty straightforward. Here you see the AWS IoT console and I created a rule that is actually talking to a Lambda function. And I'm not filtering any actions here. I'm, I'm doing a select start from IoT button and I'm passing every message that is delivered by the button to Lambda via the AWS IoT platform. So let's take a look at what I have done in AWS Lambda. This is an extremely simple function that I have written, which is going to intercept the action performed by the bulb and calls the appropriate REST API to control the LeafX bulb. As simple as that. I'm extremely impressed with the power of AWS IoT and its capability to connect with rest of the AWS services. I'm currently in the process of comparing this with Azure IoT Suite and Azure IoT Hub and expect a review very soon. This entire tutorial is going to be up on my blog along with the source code on GitHub. Thanks for watching.